I'll give you Blackbeard's honest opinion. You ask me, can this new captain promise you a life of prizes, plunder, and adventure? Aye. For amongst all the gentlemen of fortune sailing these West Indies, he ranks amongst the most clever. There was a time when I thought myself the deadliest scourge of these seas. <laughs> but this man is a fearsome dog that feeds off trouble and turmoil. I seen him clear the deck of a Spanish galleon like it were nothing. Fighting like a devil, dressed as a man. And he's a canny one. Knows his way round every crag and crevice of these islands. So if his fortune and adventure you seek, and Captain Edward Kenway's your man. Only, don't meddle in his private affairs. For there's more mystery to that man than even I dare ask. Hello homies, welcome to another let's play of um, this is your this is Ryu Art and we're playing Assassin's Creed 4. Ah oh, it's just awesome! I love it. This game is has epic story, great gameplay, and piracy. It's huge. It's really worth your money. Uh, um, there was launch title to get also. It was this one. So in order to get all the story and all the some of the things that they talk about, you kind of have to play the Assassins One through Four. I mean, Assassins One. Through two and three and all the other ones in between I kind of lost count how many there were but like and I usually wasn't really into the series but this game brought me into it because um just the scope of it is epic um just going around and doing whatever you want uh, having uh and also the controls were really good um on the first game, I didn't really like the fighting, but now it's so finely tuned that um, it's easy to get into. It's fun. Um, I really enjoyed the combat. Then, I, then there's the chasing. Oh, there's just so many elements to this game. And then the this one right now, right now that you're seeing is the pirating. You know, shooting with your ship and then battles and stuff like that. You get tons of those later on so this is really worth worth its money you know, for sixty dollars this is a really great game and you know it, ma it makes me it makes me really hopeful and really excited about the next gen or, or current gen because um scope of things that they're gonna be making and uh, you know this and this was just uh, a current gen you know one of those games that they fixed up the graphics a little bit and then uh, how can you imagine what they're gonna be able to do for Assassin's Creed 5 so he meets the assassin face to face you know and uh, he's about to kill him and then he the ship explodes. Um, you know, he didn't seem kind of a tough assassin, but um, is it dangerous? You know, and assassins are Edward. usually the ones to be feared and stuff. Um, is it dangerous? Wouldn't pay so nice if it weren't. 
Well, why not sail with the king's navy? Earn a proper wage, sail under gentlemen. Sod the navy's gentlemen. For every shilling I'd earn, the captain gets 600. That's no way to earn a fortune. We don't need a fortune. It's not about need, Caroline. I want food that don't make me sick. I want walls that hold back the wind. I want a decent life. H how long would you be gone with these privateers? A year, I reckon. Two at the most. All right. No more than two. Promise me. So, of course, I'm going to be quiet during the cutscenes because I want you to see the story and enjoy it just as I did. Um, and like I was saying, this game is huge in its proportions. Um, just the amount of things that you can do. Like side quests. You could probably spend hours on side quests. Um... The story is huge, uh, and there's just so many more things. Was it good for you as well? Havana. I must get to Havana. Well, I'll just build us another ship, will I? I can pay you. Isn't that the sound you pirates like best? One hundred Eskimos. Keep talking. Will you or won't you? You don't have that gold on you now, do you? <laughs> Bloody fucking pirates! <laughs> I'm on to you, Snakesby! And you know, the game rewards you for exploration. And uh, Come on, mate. We're just going around start. and doing side quests. Like uh, out of um, I played it through first time, and um, I literally spent like twenty hours just doing side quest. It's a you know, and upgrading my ship. Just because it's so fun going around. Um, you know, on your ship, attacking battles. You know pirating and stuff like that it, uh, and it it rarely gets um, um, you know continuous uh, uh, just the same thing over and over again it's always uh, it's always like evolving and changing in different missions and also so you'll never be you won't be bored for a long time in the, with this game. Right now, it, it, the uh, gameplay changed into a, a hunting mission, you know, where you hunt your prey or your target. You're chasing them down. And then you have to go through the landscape and stuff like that. And, um... I gotta tell you, it's really simple to like find paths and just um, explore through. I mean, sometimes you'll fall into um, into a random area, and like there there was no no time where I got stuck. 
you know and that's rare for a game where the it's the wildlife and it's supposed to be random and you know we could i mean there's no um just one path you can go around everywhere as long as you can climb it you can go there and uh the like i said the the all the areas are huge And rarely do you feel like you have another loading screen and then you have to go in into another little dungeon and then you go another screen and stuff like that. It never felt like that. It just there was a few loading screens but they were far in between and uh, So it was fun just to right now, like right now I'm chasing him down. Trying to kill him. You know, and I kind of, this, this guy, the, the story, Edward Kenway, he was fun, he was a fun character. Uh, I don't think uh, Assassin's Creed has another fun character. Um, I played number two, one, a little bit, I've never, I haven't played number three, but it just seemed a good like sto background story for it, and I saw the trailers for it. And the combat, the combat is just so fluid, it's fun. You know, and it's 3D combat, it's not like, just, um, you can move around, you can throw them around. And I, I like doing that, I like throwing them around and then sh stabbing them. Um, sometimes you do combos. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, and leave a like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. What can I improve on or anything else? Thank you, and well, uh, look out for more uh, episodes of this game. Thank you. Bye. I believe I can recognize the costume made infamous by your secret order. Therefore, come to Havana in haste, and trust that you shall be welcomed as a brother. Su más humilde servidor, el gobernador Laureano Torres y Ayala. Mr. Walpole, let's collect your reward.